Shalom, shalom everyone. How are you guys doing? I know it's a little late over there, Eastern Standard Time. Your day is almost over, but it is still early in the morning here in Hawaii. And I just wanted to come to you quickly. I'm waiting for a few of you guys to come on. You don't want to miss this and you might want to share it. You just might want to share it. <laughs> so I'm just kind of waiting for you guys to pop on, pop on, pop on. And um, this is going to be good. Um, this is the word of the Lord that he gave me um, this morning while I was at the gym working out at 530 in the morning. It's on noise cancellation. So share, share, share. This is going to be good. I promise you. I promise you. It's going to lift you up and take you to another level. Amen. And so I'm just waiting for a few more of you guys to get on. Yes, this is going to be good. This is going to be good. It's going to be good. And if you don't catch me, if you didn't catch me live, welcome to the replay. Welcome to the replay. And so um, usually every morning at 5 a.m. I get up to go to, I get up at 5 a.m. to get to the gym. And um, I get there about 5.30 in the morning. And so this morning I'm, I'm working out. I'm actually hitting the heavy bag this morning when I get this word. This, I, the Lord is so good. I promise you. This, <laughs> this is good. And so, and it helped me. Actually, when he gave me this word, it was for someone in particular. But he said, no, this word is for everybody. And I said, okay, Lord. And so, this is the word of the Lord. Noise cancellation. This is good noise cancellation and so when you think about uh, when you think about headsets that have noise cap uh, noise cancellation capability it uh, it shuts out the ambient noise what is ambient ambient means encompassing it's it surrounds it surrounds that is what ambient means ambient means surrounds and it means all in enco encompasses all around you and so when you think about noise cancellation noise cancellation is you can it cancels out everything that surrounds you everything that encompasses you all the all the other sounds all the voices and all the noise that's going around so what is noise noise is disruptive and it t and it it causes you to be distracted, stops you what from what you're doing. And so when you think about uh, uh, noise, uh, I'm sorry, headsets. God is saying headsets, headset for noise cancellation. What is He saying? That you have to cancel out all of the negativity that's around you. You have to cancel out all the discouragement that surrounds you. You have to cancel it out two ways. You have your head set now, now I'm not talking about those headsets that you buy in the store your head has to be set already on a set because when you buy a, a headset and it has noise cancellation you could switch it off or you could switch it on so you have to set it to on so that everything else that's going on out here you will not hear you will only hear what's in here so God is saying I want you to focus on my voice I want you to focus on what I'm saying to you. I want you to focus on my word. Keep all of the distractions, everything else out here, canceled out so that you don't hear any of it. And so that none of what that's going on out there will be able to affect what I am saying to you in the realm of the spirit. And so this is the word of the Lord to the body of Christ. This word is for everybody. This is not one of those words where, well, it's not for me. No, it's for everybody because we have to have our heads set. Amen. Hey, Brenda, you have to have your head set for what the word of the Lord is for your life, for your ministry, for the vision that he's given you, for your career, for your family, for your marriage, whatever it is. Your heads have to be set to cancel it out. And if there's discouragement or fear, I cancel discouragement. I cancel out fear. I cancel out insecurity. I cancel out word curses. I cancel out generational curses. I cancel it out. Cancel out the noise that keeps trying to encompass you. Remember at the top of this, I said with a natural headset, it cancels out ambient noise. Ambient means it surrounds you. It's all around. 
And so you want to cancel out that noise. You want to cancel out the negativity. You want to cancel out uh, people that are just trying to use you for what you have and who you are. You cancel them out. You cancel out everything. Thank you so much for the likes and for the hearts. Hey, Charlotte, how are you? Hey, Christine, how are you? God bless you. Hey, Brenda. And so we want to be able to cancel it out. Have your head set. You got to have it on the on position so that when the noise comes, it also it, it doesn't even touch you. You won't even hear it. You won't be affected by it. A lot of times when we are trying to do what the Lord is telling us to do, there's so many distractions. You know, when I go to the gym, I see everybody, a lot of the people there, they have on their, you know, they have on their Dr. Dre beats. They have on whatever headsets they have, the audio technicas. They have all of that on so that they don't hear everything else that's going on and so they're not distracted. They're not distracted at all. They're focused on what they're hearing in here. You got to be focused on what God is saying to you in here. You got to be focused. You got to be steadfast. You got to be unmovable. You can't allow the disruptions and the disturbances to, to stop you from where you're supposed to be going. Yeah, we cancel out fear. We cancel out discouragement. Yeah, so, and if this, is, if this message is good to you, just put in hashtag noise cancellation. Hashtag noise cancellation. I know it's a little bit of a delay on here. I know it's a bit of a delay on here. But um, get it in there. Hashtag noise cancellation. Because this is the word of the Lord. You got to be focused. You got to be on it. You got to laser focus. So that you're not hearing what other people are doing. We have people that are, are, are looking and trying to copy and they're trying to... No, we, we, we're not doing that. We just want to be who God has called us to be. We have one purpose. We have many assignments, but we have one purpose. And the purpose is that we are fruitful and we are multiplying in the earth. That which he has given us. Because that's faithfulness. Amen. Hashtag noise cancellation amen and for those of you that are listening on the replay please put in hashtag noise cancellation please do that and so i i just wanted to come on really quick and encourage you in that that there is no disruption and there is no disturbance that is able to stop you but you have to cancel it out get it out of your ears some of you guys got to get out of your own heads i'm gonna say it again some of you guys got to get out of your own head Stop trying to talk yourself out of what the word of the Lord is because it looks like it's not going to happen. It's going to happen. By faith, it's going to happen. Amen? All right, so I didn't want to really be on here long. I just wanted to come in and, and drop that in because a lot of people don't understand that words are seeds. They are seeds. And if we just let them lay there, eventually uh, what a seed does is it takes root black mustard seed you can barely see it it is very small but it is very very powerful that's a that's a small mustard seed most most mustard seeds are not black most of them because they did have different types of mustard seeds and any type of seed that you have now here's another mustard seed we give these out to people talk to them about faith this one is kind of beige but you can see it in there it's bigger than this one but this one is really tiny but what comes out of this seed is much bigger than what comes out of this seed and so no matter how slight somebody's negativity is it will take root if you do not get rid of it it will take root if you don't get rid of it I promise you and so you have to learn how to uh, some some seeds have already taken root but God is saying that you can uproot it you can uproot it but you have to go for the root, just like a weed. You have to, you can't just see it and snatch out the manifestation. No, you got to go for the root because otherwise they will just keep coming back, keep coming back over time. And so we want to, yes, by faith it will happen. And so we want to make sure that what we're doing is canceling out all the noise, canceling out all the discouragement. And so that way what's in here, what the Lord is saying to you in here and in here, there is no disruption. There is no unholy disturbances, and there is no way that the enemy can get in. Amen? There's no way. So, 
Hashtag hola, como esta mujer? <laughs> hey Janie. So we can't, we cannot allow the enemy to come in. Noise cancellation. Have your head set for noise cancellation. Have it set for noise cancellation. So that way you get rid of all of that that's encompassing, all of that is surrounding. That's what ambient means. It's not the same as like, oh, ambient music. No, ambient means surrounding and encompassing. And if it's not agreeing with what God has said, cancel it out. Cancel it out. Cancel it out. So have your head set for noise cancellation. And stay focused on what he's saying to you about your family, about your career, about, yes, hashtag noise cancellation. Let, be focused on what he's saying about the books you're supposed to write. Let him, let him cause you to be focused. That, because it's just so amazing how the Lord gave me that in the gym this morning. It was just amazing. He showed it to me. He actually showed it to me on a t-shirt where I saw somebody with headsets on and then there were some other people over there just talking, gossiping. And, but the person with the headset on couldn't hear what the gossipers were saying because they had their headset on noise cancellation. And so that's the word of the Lord. He was saying noise cancellation, cancel it out, cancel it out because it don't have nothing to do with you. Word curses, cancel them out generational curses cancel it out negativity cancel it out gossip backbiting division cancel it out discouragement insecurity cancel it out let the lord speak to you and this is the only thing that you're focused on because when you when you have your head set on noise cancellation all that other stuff that's trying to encompass and surround you you won't even hear it you won't even hear it that's right. Keep your head set. Hey, Dr. F Dr. Flip, where you been? Hey, bro, how are you? Noise cancellation. This is a good word. This is a good message because there are people that get disrupted and disturbed because they got all of this going on. They, they distracted by all of this going on, all encompassing, all around them. Stay focused. Hey, Brenda, um, and we cancel it or uh, anything. That's right. Cancel anything that's not of God. If it has nothing to do with your purpose, if it has nothing to do with your vision, if it has nothing to do with the ministry that the Lord has entrusted into, into you, into you, into your spiritual DNA, cancel it out. I know you with those young people. You doing a work, man. I, I applaud you. Guys, please follow Dr. Flip and watch what he is doing with these young people. These young people need to understand noise cancellation, Dr. Flip, because they, they too, especially with their peers, people trying to influence you to do things that you're not supposed to be doing, taking you off course and off track. Definitely, Dr. Flip, the young people need to understand noise cancellation. They got to get their heads set. And like I said before, when you buy a noise cancellation headset, it literally has a switch for you to switch it off or on. And if you switch it on, you won't hear all the other stuff that's going on. I was in the store the other day and, I, and the Lord led me to go try these headsets on. I didn't even know they were noise cancellation. And I put it on and then I, I took it off and I looked at it and I was like, oh, and I hit the switch. When I turned it on, there was a baby screaming right in Walmart. I didn't hear the baby screaming. They had all this noise going on. I didn't hear nothing. All I heard was the music and the man who was talking inside the headset. That's a word right there. That will preach. Hashtag noise cancellation. Yes, working with the youth is definitely important. When you got a ministry that's geared toward youth, and this is not just youth. This is this is this message is for everybody, but I I definitely want this to go out to the youth because they need to understand. I mean, they they already got headsets on. They got their Dr. Dre beats. They understand. They know what noise cancellation is. You don't even have to preach to them all day about that. They know hit the switch. I don't want to hear nothing. It's inside whatever's inside the headset. Whatever your mindset is, 
That's all you're going to hear because you've learned to shut out everything else. Everything that's in the headset, that's the only thing you want to hear. That, that, I, I, when, when I got in the car, I was like, okay, Lord, that will preach. That will preach not just today, but it will preach for as long as this world is turning and people are in it. Yeah, you got you to gotta listen to the voice of the man inside. That's right. You got to, that, that's, that's it right there. Hit that, that, hit that noise cancellation. Yeah, this is good. Look, I'm saying this, this is a good word. This is powerful. This is powerful. This is going to take you, I promise you, if you do this thing, it will take you to the next level because we try, we just so unfocused in this generation or we got the wrong focus and we, or we get so easily distracted so easily we doing one thing we doing it doing it and next thing we hear something out there and then we turn and we turning and we looking no we don't have time for that no focus laser focus laser focus and we and since we are made in the image of god watch this since we are made in the image of god he doesn't get distracted <laughs> God does not get distracted. He does not get distracted. And if he and if we are made in his image, that means that we can get focused and we can bear down and we can do what we need to do and we will only be focused on what's going on in the headset. We will only be focused on what's going on in the headset. We hit that noise cancellation switch, we good. That's and and we won't hear nothing else. So we cancel distraction, we cancel gossip, we cancel insecurity, we cancel word curses, we cancel negativity, we cancel, cancel, cancel. We're not trying to hear it. So that'll take that term, I ain't trying to hear you, to another level. Noise cancellation. Hashtag noise cancellation. Hey, blessings. Hey, Cindy, how are you? If this is good to you, please hashtag noise cancellation. Oh, I miss you too, Brenda. Yeah, we are so easily distracted. Yeah, we got to be focused on the voice of the Lord. Hashtag noise, look, hashtag noise cancellation. Let that be your meditation this week. Because I know for some of you that are listening live and for those of you that are coming on the replay there's a work that the lord has given you in particular um and i don't mean in general for your ministry and your career but there is a a a work in particular and he is saying that you cannot get distracted in this season something might look good or sound good but he's like no i need you on the narrow path he said it's the narrow path but few that find it and that's because we got all this noise in our ear. We got the noise comes and then we, we, we off course. We looking to see what it is. He said, you don't have to look. He said, I got your back. You don't need to turn around. You don't need to be distracted. You don't need to pay it any, no. Noise cancellation, get your head set. I can't say it enough. Get your head set. Get your mind set on noise cancellation. And that which he has given you to do, you will be able to do it. Sweatless. This time, sweatless. As long as you don't stay disrupted, disturbed, and distracted. Single-minded. Mindset. Hashtag noise cancellation. Okay, guys, that's all I got for you now. Short, sweet, and to the point. Um, Thank you so much for joining me today on facebook live i had to i had to drop this over at periscope and i haven't been on periscope in forever but i had to i had to because those that follow me over there i did not want them to miss this so i'm gonna go because look my mind is set (laughs) my head is set on noise cancellation and um i love you guys so much i miss you all and um i will talk to you guys later Shalom. <laughs> Shalom. Hey, Dr. Flip, keep you in prayer, family. I'm speaking to the students, parents, and teachers. Okay, Dr. Flip, I got you. I got you. 
Uh, matter of fact, I'm going to pray now while we're on. And, and I want all of us to agree with Dr. Flip. As I said before, he works with, uh, he works with youth. He is influencing young minds um, to the glory of God. And so, Father, I just thank you for, uh, for Dr. Flip, Dr. William. And I thank you, God, for, for the ministry and the vision that you've given him. Thank you, Lord God, that he is an influence into the youth, the next generation that is coming behind us. Lord, I thank you, Father God, for just seeding him in your wisdom so that he knows how to go in and out before these young people. Thank you, Father God, for surrounding him with the, uh, the, the aptitude and and the, the, the genius of being able to speak and impart into them, Lord God, and let his words fall on them like seeds and that these seeds would, would move deep into the, their, these earthen vessels and take root and that they do not depart from anything that he's teaching them according to your word, oh God, let this thing be done. Father, we stand in agreement for who you have called him to be in this hour before these young ones. Lord, I thank you, Father God, that these will raise up, they will raise up they will raise up and they will in turn raise up others lord god that they will also be an influence that dr flip is just doing what you said in genesis he's being fruitful and he is multiplying he is multiplying he is reproducing himself in the earth through these young people lord i thank you father god that these will be young men who will grow up to be uh fathers to their children and husbands to their wives that they will be entrepreneurs that they will be visionaries and luminaries in the earth lord god lord that they will be men that will be righteous men that they will be prophets that they will be apostles that they will be evangelists pastors and teachers lord that they will be men of influence and men of renown in the earth i thank you for uh, dr william flips influence in their lives i thank you father god for sending your word to him sending your word encouraging him lord that there will be those that will walk with him to encourage him and to support the vision that you've given him and so father i thank you that even he will begin to understand noise cancellation in a greater measure and for everyone that is listening i pray mm, that they will get into a place where they can cancel out noise. That they will be able to disrupt the disruption of the enemy. I thank you, Father God, for every listener, whether they are live or whether they are on the replay. Lord God, that they will begin to uh, covet this whole idea and teaching on noise cancellation so that they can get to where they can get to undistracted undisturbed and undisrupted and father god i just thank you for the, the for the various ministries and visionaries that are here lord that and i decree and declare i proclaim that they will make it they will get to the finish line they will do all that you've given them to do and they will do it with ease in this season in this season in this season in this season they shall do it Lord, I thank you, Father God, for, for increase. Like even, even as, hallelujah, this little mustard seed, this little mustard seed, this, this black mustard seed, which is more powerful than the beige mustard seed, that it will, they will yield even as unto this mustard seed. And so, Father, I thank you for increase. I thank you for the personal development. I thank you for the wisdom that only comes from you. Not the wisdom of man, but the wisdom that only comes from you. I thank you for witty inventions and, and, and teachings and craftings. Lord, I thank you, Lord, for just for just loving on your people in this season and giving them, conferring upon them the grace that they need to, to win this race and to influence the people to turn towards you. And I just ask you for, for, for this increase in Yeshua's name. Amen and amen. Hey, Tammy. Yes, Lord, fill us up, Lord God, that we would be aligned, that we would be aligned with your purpose. All of us, all of us. And Father, if there's any, any sin anywhere in the camp, show it to us. We turn and we repent. We turn and we repent so that there is no spot, nor is there any wrinkle that will hinder us. And Lord, I thank you. I thank you for each and every one. I thank you, Father God. Hallelujah. And I pray, guys, that you just share. Share this. Please share it out. Share it out. I pray for even the replay viewers. I pray the same prayer for the replay viewers. Thank you, Lord God. Only he has the power to increase. He gives the increase. One plants. <laughs> See that little seed in there? One plants. One waters. But he, he is the only one that gives the increase. 
So we, we cancel the noise. Have your head set for noise cancellation. God bless you. I will see you on the next one. Um, love you guys with the Ahav, the love of the Lord. And the increase. Increase is your portion. As long as you have your head set for noise cancellation. Thank you for the hearts and the likes. I love you. Shalom, shalom.